Hi, Jonathan Stark here, and I just wanted to quickly show you how easy it is to modify the default slide-in selectors uh, with JQ Touch. And this came up today because uh, my friend Graham Sprigg, who's putting together this GMAC wallpaper site, chatted me. Uh, he couldn't figure out a bug he was having. The site is basically a simple drill down from this list of categories into a list of images, and you can click on that to drill down to the image. So it's a three-level hierarchy. And the problem was when he got to this page and clicked on an image, it wouldn't slide. And it was interesting because when he was clicking on it, we weren't getting any JavaScript errors, and the URL was updating appropriately. Um, so after thinking about it for a minute, uh, I realized that the problem was that his HTML code on this page wasn't set up in a way that um, JQ Touch would know to slide those clicks left. And so what do I mean by that? Um, by default, JQ Touch is uh, applies slide left to um, links that are inside, A tags that are inside of list items which are inside unordered lists. So the default selector is ULLIA. So if you have any of those in your application and you add JQ Touch, so when someone clicks, it's going to slide to the target. And what Graham had in this particular case was just loose A tags. So he could have either wrapped these in a uh, you know in an unordered list and changed his CSS to make it look the way he wanted. But what he actually did was um, uh, the easier thing. If we look at the source, uh, he added some selectors uh, to the JQ Touch uh, default. So when you instantiate JQ Touch, you can add a bunch of properties in here to modify the behavior. And what he did was he specified that he did still want the uh, ULLIA selectors to slide left. He also wanted the A dot categories to slide left, and that's the class that categories the class he applied to those. Uh, thumbnails, and then uh, he also indicated that he wanted all anchor tags to slide left, so he probably could have omitted these other two uh, and just used this A tag. Uh, I would actually argue that it might make sense for the JQ Touch default to be any uh, A tag uh, making a slide left, uh, but I guess Dave's got his reasons. I don't know if uh, I don't know if it's okay for me to lobby here <laughs> for, for slide left on the naked A tag, but uh, I think that makes sense to me, although I haven't really thought it through that, that much. At any rate, hopefully this will help uh, someone out there uh, prevent you from smashing your keyboard into little bits, wondering why it doesn't work. Um, and I will talk to you soon. Thanks.